political analysts say Bersatu will benefit from allowing open contests for the party's top five positions, which are currently limited to Supreme Council members who have served two terms. Shaza Shukri of International Islamic University in Malaysia said Bersatu would strengthen itself by developing a broader talent pool if prominent figures such as Information Chief Asmin Ali and Secretary General Hamza Zainuddin competed for top posts. She also said having new leaders with stronger credentials to fill top party positions could help Bersatu demand a more equal footing in Perikatan Nasional. On Wednesday, Bersatu grassroots members called for flexibility in nominating the party's top five positions. They expressed concern about the party's future after poor performances in several state polls and losing the recent Kuala Kubu Baharu by election. Meanwhile, political analyst James Chin of University of Tasmania said the call by grassroots members had shown that members want stronger figures such as Hamza and Asmin to lead the party. He said it was obvious that the grassroots in Bersatu were unhappy with the current leadership. Chin also said grassroots members want Bersatu to do more because they think the party is playing second fiddle to pass in the PN alliance. He said the grassroots want the top leadership to step up because Bersatu's number one enemy is AMNO, and if AMNO gains ground, it's Bersatu that loses, not pass.